What's up, bunch of savages? Savage Mister here. I'm here on the first day of Fright Fest. There it is. Oh yeah, yeah, it's still daylight. Just wait. Y'all come inside with me. That's cool, look at that. First night of Fright Fest, it is going to be packed, I bet you. Oh yes, it's up until midnight tonight as well. Um, so let's see where how far back I'm parked. But you know what, I'm probably not going to be riding mini rides anyway. Uh, I'm just going to be checking out the scare zones mostly. But I'll see what I can ride. I'd like to ride at least the train because it's got some... Anything that has a Halloween theme to it, I'd like to ride it. So. And of course, you're going to score on uh, Metropolis, right? Here's a tip for you. If you're looking for parking, as I am, if you see cars coming out, they're not necessarily having no luck down these aisles finding parking, right? If they have small kids in the car, go down that way. They could very well be just leaving the park for the night because, you know, once the sun goes down, it's time to leave for kitties. And then it's uh, scary time the whole rest of the night. So, yeah, little tip for you. Check it out, this guy did a parking job. I thought I had a spot, but he's on the line and somebody's already put a note on his windshield probably saying you're a total jerk for doing that. Two spaces, that guy. I'm skipping the hat and the glasses, the shades, uh, because the sun will be down soon. I didn't bring the camera glasses at all because It'll be too dark to record anything. Um, I also wanted to skip all that stuff so I could have a lighter load. So whenever I gotta run from creepers, I can run a little easier. I've already got being fat and old against me, so I need all the help I can get. I'm gonna go over and check out that note that was on that truck. The scariest thing I've seen so far, dirty diaper. Yikes. I'm back over here by this truck with the note on it. The crappy parking job. Here comes somebody. Everybody that pulls up thinks they can park here. Without touching your truck, I need to see the note. The way you pulled in makes me wish your dad would have pulled out. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's awesome. Oh, that's the funniest thing I've seen in a long time. If you don't understand that one, yeah, I'm not gonna. Oh, that's good. Oh, man. All right. Let's go in and have some more fun. See all these people coming out? They're called chicken butts. They're afraid of the creepers. If you're a chicken butt, too, don't be all offended. I'm just messing around. There's some more chicken butts trying to get out before it gets crazy. Get out before the sun goes down. What do we have here? Nice and creepy. Dude, those dudes are gnarly. couple of bird brains over there. Dang! There's how they beat me in court if I die of a heart attack. Disclaimer! So far there are a lot of bodies and um, I'm gonna guess that a lot of them are leaving though because it's you know time to get out. So. Like I say, uh, we're close to the entrance, so there's loads of people that are on their way out, and that's a good thing. What do we got over here? I didn't think they would put anything in the uh, kids' zone, but here's some kind of circus clown situation. Wow, wow. Take a selfie with me and tag Six Flags over Texas. Wow. Check out the bony dog, man. Throw that dog a bone, he's got enough. Crazy. Madame Zenobia. It's like a circus scare zone right here. And you gotta pass through it in order to get by. Dang, KFC getting revenge. Chicken eating folks right there. Oh, this dude's got caught by a spider. There's another one right there. 
Dang, dude. It smells crap over here. I wonder what this is. Ooh, a new a new walkthrough area, a new ride possibly. It's just construction. Nothing special, just construction. All right, I'm gonna make my way around and get a snack, and then I might even ride up in Tropolis because it's still daylight. So I'm gonna get fed, get fat, and keep on rolling. I hear the train are coming. I hear the train, but usually it shuts off before it gets dark. I think so. Hopefully they'll leave it open later to, and run it later tonight because it's right past. But we'll see. They've got some creepy kids over here. Look at this, dude, gnarly. They got a creepy trick or treat clown kid right there. Here's a guy begging for chains. <laughs> chains, black chains, but ch dude, look at this. It's like the demonic Easter Bunny. Holy mackerel! Look at that. Wow. Some kind of creepy bear. <laughs> That's a lot of people down there going both ways, y'all. The free cups of water, they finally got smart and made it self-serve. That's how you do it. I got mine. Dang, we got a, a, a zombie hillbilly with uh, dynamite. Dynamite. Passing by here, there he is. Is that him? Yep. Passing by here to get on the train, I saw Tim, my contest winner. And uh, that was cool to meet us to see Tim again. Hey, it was good to see you again, Tim. All right, let's get on the train and see what we can see. There's a quite a line. We might not be able to get on this one, but it's not like it's not like I need a whole room for you know room for a whole family. It's just me, so it should be all right. I'll just squeeze in over in the corner somewhere. The craziest one of course you've ever been on in your entire life. So wait, 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 wait. Just keep waiting, keep waiting, man. Be excited. Be very happy. We're coming up on the tunnel. It is great fest, so let's hear your best scream. <laughs> Well, they did put a uh, skeleton there. Little small skeleton hanging there. Oh, it's like a skeleton fish. Oh my gosh. Look, zombie tamales. Zombie tamales. Yep, the water does look like it is red on the uh, log ride. This is it? Oh man, that sucks. Aww. Oh, that's wasted footage. Somebody trying to climb in or out of the bathroom. They got something here that says Giant Carnival over there by the Giant, yeah, Giant Carnival. I'm going over here by the Bubba's Texas Dogs and I see, I see Lanny and, and Nell right there. I'm going back here to show y'all the air conditioning. I, I don't think I've actually stepped in here to show it to you since, but here it is. It's running, there it is, I feel it. It's not as cold as it usually is, but yeah, this is it right here. I'll go back up here and say hey to uh, Lanny and Nell. Instead of your usual tattoos, you can get fake wounds put on. She's got a bullet, a bullet hole in her head. Check out this guy. They got a couple zombies in the jeep. He's got a microphone. But I don't hear anything. The zombie infestation. I'm gonna get to show a lot of people getting scared. It'll be fun for y'all to see. I ain't gonna get scared. I don't, I don't get scared. Is that a fake British accent? You have to go get a ticket. VIP entrance. Oh, you can get a entrance is right here. Oh, the microphone's house. cutting out. Haunted house passes are right here. There's the price list. Have a look and see what you think. There's everybody buying there. Hey, everybody at Piggy's. Trey's coming through. <laughs> He's coming by himself. Give him a good time. Piggy's slaughterhouse. Home for swine dining like that. I guess this is for later on if they expect it to get crazy. Crazy long line, they'll put them, everybody in here. I ought to listen to that lady's English accent, take it home to my wife and let her put her to the test. Sounds a little phony to me. Check it out, right? Up this tree, even though it's Halloween, they've already started with the uh, Christmas lights. Here's a crazy scarecrow right here. They've got more lights going up the um, stairs on this tree. And then over here they've got Boo Hill. Looks like a picture of like, uh, looks like a picture that I've seen of, uh, what's his name, Billy the Kid. Billy the Dead Kid now. Here's a couple of them over here. 
They're getting ready. There's a couple right there. Yeah, Yosemite Sam Gold River Adventure is closed. I think they could have shut off all the Bugs Bunny stuff in there and put scare actors all inside that place. That would have been a nice little ride through of fear, you know? Those people might be the last riders of the night because there's no others coming through. Yep, probably the last ones. Over here by the old Chaparral Cars entrance, well, the new old one, they've got a whole thing with drinks and cream puffs and things they're selling. It looks like they've got beer here and uh, <laughs> some beer and looks like skull um, mugs. They've got another booth set up here. Looks like some snacks and drinks and the like. That's pretty cool. Got a creepy scarecrow over here. Do his eyes glow? I promise I don't bite. I don't believe you. We've already seen the rapids with the bloody water. But here it is again. Right. Now we've, we've got Circus Berserkus over here. Haunted House Pass, the same passes. If you get the VIP or the one that covers all houses, then you can just buy it one of them and it's good at all of them. So knock yourselves out. And then around the other side is the uh, Cadaver Hall or something like that. They've actually got officers at each, at each haunted house, which is probably smart. Because you always get that one jerk that says, I'm going to knock somebody out if they scare me. Well, don't go in. Then don't go in. You're just causing trouble. People are trying to have fun. Like I said, the Circus Berserkus is around there. And over here is the uh, yeah, Cadaver Hall morgue. Once you're in, there's no coming out. Well, then you should probably do this one last then. If you do this one first, you won't get to visit the others. I want to know where the, in where the exits are. I'd like to know. Maybe they're around back. I'm going to go around back and see. If the entrance is around there, this is, there's somebody in costume. They don't have this thing put up, but they should. I think this may be the exits. I could be wrong. If it's just the personnel, then I shouldn't be there. But I saw one of the clowns in like a half dress. Ooh. I almost saw his honker. Honk, 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 honk. Check out this creepy big zombie over here. It's almost, it's a little bit reminiscent of Eddie from uh, Iron Maiden a little bit. Just a bit. Here's some of the creepy music they've got over the area. That's good. This is the voodoo swamp. Ooh, creepy. I'll be back at dark, as you know. Here's another one of these creepy zombies. Check him out, he's got like a skeleton in his hand. The zombie fisherman. And everything's creepy. So there's the creepy ring toss right there. How about the ring toss? Like the movie The Ring? Come on, y'all. Here's another creepy redneck over here. This one's got a shovel. Another dude with a shovel. Uh-oh, look. We got clowns scaring folks. He's walk up and give them a scare. They're starting to come out. It's the second one I've seen. Let's let's watch him. Go up there and tell him I want to float. I want to float, too. This one's having party time. This has also got Christmas lights up here. And Christmas lights on this tree as well. And that one. I guess they just start that early. Even over there on where I got nachos. Also got Christmas lights. I guess they, you know, it takes a long time to do the decorations. Shovel, dude. Keep shoveling, bruh. This guy here can't have, can't have a drink because he's a miner. Ha, ha. They've got blackout over here. I'm guessing, yeah, it's going to be one of the haunted houses. This is the normal karaoke section. This must be the scary We got another food booth over here with some nice decorations. That's cool. We got a scary lady right here. I think she's got a microphone. What's that all about? Yeah, I went, I went back by Joker. There's nothing really in this area. It's too carnival-y, you know? So, you, you can't really get it dark enough to scare anybody, really. I'm going to go up here by Sky Screamer and Judge Roy Scream and see if there's any kind of decorations over there. There is that uh, theater that's just right here beside me. Uh, I wonder what they're playing in there. Uh-oh. Venue closed for private event. Okay. I figured they would have done one of their shows here. Guess not. Here's Boo and his brother over there. Let's see who that is. They've got uh, the thoroughfare that goes to Kittyland sort of is uh, all closed off. There's Boo over there. 
I can see up his skirt and his brother Hal over here. What's up, Hal? Hey, that's uh, he's the guy that uh, Halloween is named after. Of. It's named after Halloween, right? Yeah. Last name is Ween, middle name is Oliver. Shut up. Man, there are a lot of people here, man. Check it out. That's up there by Metropolis. Guy tried to put his hand in my shot. It didn't work, bro. A lot of people, y'all. They're everywhere. All right, it's dusk. Sun's going down. Uh, go hit Metropolis. I got a 779, but I didn't get the uh, secret as you can tell, and that's not my high. So I uh, completed the um, the um, what you call it, the panel with um, Cyborg twice in that one, but still didn't get my high. I've got to learn some more. Y'all give me some more tips. You don't want me to go turn OP, do you? Kidding. All right, it's getting darker. Where's all the creepers? Hey y'all, I'm sitting here in the editing uh, process. I'm already at 16 minutes and haven't even got to the dark part of Six Flags, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here and pick up the next video when it's dark and the creepers start coming out. So, see y'all in the next one. Y'all say savage. Subscribe and share and send money.